Can you salad. tell me a little bit about the uh, mashed potatoes? You can use about this one, this okay. one, but I would advise two cups okay. of mashed potato flakes, hot water and salt. All right. And then make it into a thick mashed potato, not soft. Okay. Ah. So it spreads easily on the bread. Okay. Got Stan, you, you want the recipe for that? Uh, we'll, we'll put it in the caption. Okay. okay. So that's the filling. filling. Beef filling. And then we have our eggs okay. and the bread and uh, bread crumbs. Okay, so next we're taking the bread slices and um, taking off the edges. It has to be fresh bread, okay? Otherwise, it won't bail this at this, so you can't roll up it. <laughs> so you don't need to wet it, huh? Nothing, you just roll it out a bit. Okay. Interesting. I think that's what I was doing wrong, was making it wet and then it would... Make it pretty thin, okay? Yeah. Ah. So, a little bit warm, we'll wait till it cools down a bit. So, after we roll the bread, then you put the mashed potatoes on it, right? Mm. Okay, that is good, okay, and just a thin layer, very thick, not very thick, Sorry. not very thin. It will hold the filling, it will hold the filling a bit. Okay, the filling in. And then we'll give the recipe of how we made the beef. And they can also put anything. Anything, want, right? anything. They can even vegetables, put chicken. Vegetables, You chicken. can put, uh, you know, veg boiled vegetables. With. Yes. Or you can even put mayonnaise and chicken. Yeah. Like the chicken salad thing. Got it. And you can even put cheese in it if you want. Mm -hmm. Okay, this way. Okay. Then you roll them. Like this. Okay. And then cut it. Then you take some mashed potato. Seal the sides. Yeah. Oh, very good. And then, oh, up, then you dip them in beaten egg and breadcrumbs, and you can freeze them. Okay. And they freeze very well, and they will last up to three to four months. Do you freeze them after you dip them? Yes, after you dip, everything is done. Then you spread okay. them in a cookie sheet and then freeze them. Got it. Okay, so okay. it works out better that way. See, this is done. All right. Perfect. First, we dip them in the egg and then in the breadcrumbs. Then the oil is being heated. 